Welcome back to MMA and Jamming with the mighty Kyle Chin. And then I just want to jump right to Alex Cowboy Oliveira, Brazilian Cowboy Oliveira versus Peter Sabata. Yo, let me tell you something. So this fight is super interesting and I, and I have to go straight to talking about Peter Sabata. So the other day I was, I was actually looking into Peter Sabata and, and before that somebody actually sent me a, a clip, Shane, big up yourself of an interview that Sabata was doing and where he's talking about and this is years back where he talks about representing Jamaica now this is a German Polish fighter who wants to represent Jamaica tell me something at large yo I saw him big <laughs> originally from Poland but you stay here in Germany yeah. but you said you wanted to represent Jamaica yes what was that all about uh, you know I was born in Poland, but raised in Germany, so the media and the fans always ask me, do you represent Poland or Germany? And I think it's a, it's a stupid question, because, you know, I have two hearts inside my soul, a Polish and a German heart, and whatever I say, one side always feels bad, you know? And this is why I choose to represent Jamaica, just to send out the message. Will you actually be coming in with the jersey, Jamaican jersey? It was too late to change it, but I asked for it. But on the tail of the tape, I will walk out with the Jamaican flag, you know? So I always say, I'm born in Poland, raised in Germany, but in the heart, I'm a Jamaican. Okay, thank you very much for the interview and uh, good luck on Saturday. Thank you very much. Uh, I spent one month in Jamaica uh, last year, so I got to know the country, I got to know the people, and I really, really liked it. That's amazing, because the last time we spoke, that's when you kind of said, yes, I'm going to represent Jamaica. So you actually did go to Jamaica, you spent a month there. What was it like in terms of the culture, the food and the people and everything else that you experienced there? You know, like every country, it has its good and the bad side. It's, um, it's a pretty poor country, so the people there have very different problems than we have in, in Germany, where I live. But I have never seen such friendly and like and people with such a good mood you know they are dancing all the time and and partying and everybody is just so friendly so it was an amazing experience it was amazing i, I was there with a fellow ufc fighter Krzysztof Jotko and two other friends so we were a group of four and we really spent the whole month there we were, were there over christmas new year's eve and we went across the whole island we climbed to the highest mountain we visited all cities so it was like a really really good experience and I really feel at home now in Jamaica I have to say <laughs> that's brilliant brilliant so so that's Peter Zabata and and he literally when you see the fight card well look at this picture so the man represents it man talks about walking out with the Jamaican flag all kind of things I think it's great I didn't see this interview I saw the interview before this before he had come to Jamaica and he talks about his influences with Bob Marley and so on and how much he he respects the mentality of the Jamaican people and so on. But all around interesting fight. Definitely, I wish, I wish about all the best. One love, my brother. Big up yourself. I hope you win. <laughs> yeah, man. Moving on.